Secondly, I think we all recognise that Malaysia is growing older at a much faster pace now. Um, and, you know, based on the Department of Statistics and the EPU's projections, we'll be an aged nation by 2030, uh, 2035. And therefore, it's you know, in our interest to make sure that we cater now uh, basically for this growing population um, of our membership who are going to get older faster um, and reach their retirement ages uh, probably earlier than they should. So what we're doing basically, as you know, we have already in this year um, increased uh, the uh, maximum span of life uh, that we allow our members to hold their money with us uh, to 100 years old from previously 75. Uh, we are now also essentially uh, providing flexibility uh, to all those uh, members uh, in terms of basically how they then draw down the money um, over the long term. Um, so again, like I said, because of uh, our move towards a more technology-driven process, uh, we are now able to effectively abolish a lot of the pre-requirements uh, for them to withdraw their money uh, in terms of partial withdrawals at the age of 55 and 60. Uh, and effectively, we're moving to a system whereby they can uh, essentially uh, withdraw their money uh, any amount, any time under partial withdrawal. And under monthly withdrawals, basically, they can set up standing instructions for as low as 100 ringgit a month uh, for them to transact uh, with us. So again, this gives more flexibility to members uh, for them to cater for themselves. Uh, they can decide exactly how much money they need um, and draw down exactly how much they require. And uh, with the abolishment of the pre-requirements uh, for partial withdrawals, effectively, they are no longer in a bind if they have a sudden emergency and they need to withdraw money. They can now come to us uh, without having to wait for the uh, time period to, to end.